Well, AP Racing's been around since um, since the late 60s, in one form or another, and you know we've been providing parts for Formula One for as long as many years as that. In fact, we've had uh, a clutch or a caliper on every championship winning car since the 60s. Last year, we had 90% of the cars were on uh, an AP Racing clutch, um, and about 60% were using the brakes. With solid works, you can create forms and shapes that you never believe possible. To draw in a 2D system, you have to actually visualize it, visualize it in your mind before you even pick up a pencil. You know, with 3D, you actually see the 3D shape in front of your eyes, so you can create better designs. It's taken caliper design forward to something you wouldn't believe, the, the, the shapes and things you can create in F1 calipers. It just enables you to, to get as much weight out of them as possible and to make the best, lightest and stiffest caliper there is. The first caliper I ever designed in SolidWorks I did without any training. It was easy to use and it's as easy and as fun to use now. It's just got better and better and better. I could not imagine what it would be like doing it in 2D you now. You know, we wouldn't, we certainly could not do any FE analysis on any caliper, so for every design it would be hit and miss as to whether we actually hit the target. And it would, actually, it would have to actually made the part, you know, to find out if it was actually any good. And if it wasn't, then you'd waste a lot of money and a lot of time getting there. But with SolidWorks, because you can so easily recreate each and every iteration of your design in FE and get the results out of it, you just get a better design before you've even made it. And you've got to trust SolidWorks, you've got to trust the FEA, and after seven years of using it, you know, you know that it's going to give you the right answer.